Yeah. Ten on your side has learned that Norfolk police issued a search warrant in connection with the murder of an ODU student. Court documents show a witness in the shooting death of Christopher Cummings identified a man from a photo lineup, a man the witness says was at Cummings' house the day he died. Cummings was shot and killed at his off-campus apartment on West 42nd Street on June 10th. Ten of your side's Ann McNamara is live in the Wavy Newsroom with reaction to this new development from the victim's father. And Nicole, police are being very careful with this search warrant. They're saying there is still no person of interest in this investigation, but the Cummings family tells Ten on Your Side they hope that this search warrant will be the lead that will be enough to crack this case wide open. And it did feel like it was forever. A break in the search for 20-year-old Christopher Cummings' killer. Cummings' father, James, hearing the news he's been waiting for. I was kind of like losing hope that the police would ever find anybody because, uh, uh, as you know, it's coming up on three months right now. Uh, the Old Dominion University student shot to death in his apartment two blocks off campus at 4.30 in the morning. <laughs> my, my son ended in this room and I can't believe that again. I, I just could not believe it. Police say there's still no person of interest, but court documents dated August 15th, they say police searched the home of a 20-year-old Newport newsman. Christopher told him, he said, take a look at this guy. If anything happens, uh, just remember this guy's face, you know, and you can tell the police what he looks like. Cummings' father isn't sure if it's the same man police say a witness identified in a six-photo lineup. The witness told police the man was involved in a, quote, incident at Cummings' house just hours before he died. Christopher's father says it was a fight and a gun was pulled on his son. Christopher forced the two guys that he did not know out of his house. Ten on your side has learned there is another search warrant for the home Cummings rented. This one sealed, and it will stay that way until someone is arrested. Do you believe there's going to be a day when you see that killer face to face? Absolutely. I, I, I believe it's going to happen before the end of the year. That was James Cummings, Christopher's father. Many of you know his uncle is actually Maryland Congressman Elijah Cummings. And today I spoke to Elijah after he heard the news. I asked him that same question. I said, do you think you will see the killer face to face one day? Congressman Cummings said this. If it's the last thing I do on this earth, I'm going to make sure that this person is brought to justice. Um, and it's not so much for Christopher. Christopher is gone. Uh, it's for the many other students at Old Dominion. It's for the many people who walk the streets of Norfolk. The Cummings family wants to remind the public they are offering a $10,000 reward, and they strongly urge anyone with tips to call the crime line. Reporting live in the newsroom, I'm Ann McNamara, 10 on your side.